what's going on guys it's your boy by me and today i'm going to show you how to install and set up open bore for xbox dev mode all credit to the open bore uwp port to whirly dl and if you guys enjoy his app ports to dev mode please consider tipping on his ko-fi i'll have this link down below as well all right so for this tutorial you will need two things you will need this open bore msix bundle and also you will need to use an external drive for this app so if you do have one, all you have to do is inside the root of your external drive, you have to create a open bore folder. And within that, create a logs folder, a packs folder, a saves folder, and also a screenshots folder. And then for those who do not know, where you would put your packs for your open board games is right into this packs folder. So just drag and drop your games into here and then you should be good. You can find this file within the Xbox dev store. I will also have this link down below. And you can also find this within the Revive Community Discord, where you can get tons of support questions, help with anything that you're having trouble on, or also just discussing apps that could be ported to UWP. This is a brand new dev store created by Moon Power. It's completely updated, and it has all the latest versions of everything for UWP within this. And big shout out to everyone else who's also been contributing and helping out set up this dev store with Moon. Now I'm going to show you the remote access at the bottom. So simply click on remote access settings. And what we're going to do is enable the Xbox dev portal. What this will do is this is where we will install our apps. We would have to do this from the computer or your phone. Make sure to keep a screenshot of this because anytime you want to enter the access portal on your computer, you're going to have to use either one or two links, whichever one works for you. And then at the bottom, there's an the authentication where you can set a password and username. Me personally, I just keep this unchecked. It's just a little easier to get onto the page without having to enter your information every time. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna leave our Xbox on this page, I bet. So what we're gonna do is switch over to the PC. We're gonna enter in one of the links for the access portal. And then there's some settings we're gonna change from there. And then you should be good to go. All right, now that we're on the computer, what we're gonna do is enter in one of those links. Yes, please add the HTTPS within it. And then once you enter in the link, you should get a page that says your connection is not private. Attackers might attempt to steal your information. Simply at the bottom, click on advanced and proceed. All right, bet once you get to the dev portal, all we gotta do is go under my games and apps, click on add. Now we just gotta drag and drop that open board MSIX bundle right into it. Click on next. There's no dependencies for this, so just click on start. And then once it says it's registered, just click on done. Now we're going to head to the Xbox and make sure everything loads in. I right, bet first thing you want to do when you get to the Xbox is hover over open board and click the select button on it. Go to view details. And if it's not set to a game, make sure to change it from an app to a game. And then once you do that, open it right up. I right, bet now that we're here, if you have more than one game, then you should get the list like this. But if you only have one pack in the folder, then it should just boot right into your game. Please keep in mind this is still a test build and to select your game from the list you have to press the start button on your controller. If you press A it will show the logs and there's currently no key to get out of this so then you would have to restart your app. Please keep that in mind. So now we're just going to start into a game just to show you it works. And just like that you installed and set up open bore for Xbox dev mode. I hope this video helped. If it did, please give it a like. If you enjoy tutorials like this for dev mode, please make sure to follow for more videos and I hope to catch you guys on the next one.